What is going on everybody? Welcome to another box opening video. This time around, we actually get the opportunity to open a collector's booster box of Zendikar Rising. Now, obviously we try and do one of these every single time a new set comes out and these collector booster boxes are always a really big fan favorite. There's a lot of awesome cards you can get in here. Uh, so we're gonna go through these one by one a little bit slowly. There's less packs, but a lot of awesome stuff you can get. Uh, I also just wanna mention thank you, hugely thank you to Grand Slam. Uh, they've been working with us a lot recently uh, and really since the since day one of us uh, kind of becoming a channel they've been doing a lot with us and I really really appreciate the support that they've shown us we get two box toppers look at that uh, really appreciate the support that they've shown us uh, and it certainly means a lot. Please do go check them out. Their Facebook group is linked down below. Uh, they're also sponsoring our kind of daily crack-a-pack kind of thing that we're doing on um, uh, Instagram. So if, if you're over there on Instagram, uh, give them a, sh a follow and a shout out as well. We really would appreciate it. And let's go ahead and jump in. Love these apps. Ugh, so cool. This set has been really fantastic so far. I've thoroughly, thoroughly enjoyed it. So I hope that you guys have. Uh, our first card here, little coffee token. I like that. All right, there we go. Uh, Mesa Lynx foil, absolutely fantastic. Reclaimed the Waste, Deadly Alliance, Seagate Vanaret, Scale the Heights, Roost of Drakes, sorry, uncommon. Tangled Flora Hedron. <laughs> Ooh, beautiful full art, planes, foil, absolutely fantastic. Ooh, there we go. Uh, Uvan, I believe, Moldaya Ancestor. Fantastic, I believe that's a commander card, but love that extended artwork. Uh, squad Commander, nice foil rare. We've got a Spitfire Legac, I hope I'm saying that correctly. Uh, we have got a Skyclave Squid. Ooh, and a beautiful Clearwater Pathway with Murkwater Pathway, of course, on the backside. Uh, and a Ruin Crab, as well as an Inscription of Ruin. Look at all these beautiful, beautiful cards, guys. Absolutely stunning. Let's, uh, let's organize, just, just for a second here. Let's, let's kind of get things in order. There we go, let's get things a little, a little more squared away here. All right, absolutely love these, and again, a huge thank you to Grand Slam. I hope that you guys are enjoying the new set. Uh, so far, I am loving it, as I said. Uh, really enjoying some of the new standard decks that we're seeing. I think there's a lot of awesome stuff that's coming out of this one. Uh, while I don't think it's perfect, uh, we're obviously having a few issues starting off here uh, with things like Omnath as well as um, uh, Scoot Swarm uh, in a couple decks. But overall, I think it's going very well. It's a it's a shift. Uh, it's a very nice meta shift to, from what we used to have. So I'm happy about that. Ooh, Nighthawk Scavenger. <laughs> Love that card. Uh, Bright Claim Pathway, Bright Climb, excuse me, and then Grim Climb Pathway. Very nice. Uh, Foil Rares, where did I put you? There we go. Uh, Canyon Jerboa, another Ruin Crab. Not Foil this time, that's okay. Skyclave Shade, look at that beautiful artwork. Oh my gosh, it's absolutely stunning. Uh, Dreadworm, Foil. And then finishing that off with a Maddening Cacophony. Look at that, absolutely stunning. Uh, I am gonna just zoom in just slightly, just slightly here, uh, so we can get a better look at some of these cards a little closer up. Uh, let's get that token, there we go. All right, Practice Tactics, Fisher Wizard, Broken Wings, Feed the Swarm. Kinda going a little quickly through these uh, commons and uncommons. Obviously, a lot of these are just foil versions, so there's nothing super spectacular, but still very nice. Beautiful foil planes. Skyclave Relic. Beautiful extended art. Nahiri's Lithia Forming. Fantastic as well. Or, there we go. Uh, oops, oops, oops. There we go. Uh, Akam Hellhound. Brushfire Elemental. Look at... Guys, I love that they do these showcase frames and they change them up every once in a while. It's just so nice. Oh, beautiful pathway. Whoops. And then, of course, beautiful on the other side as well. A Nectar Pot. Love that. Ooh, and a foil Nighthawk Scavenger. Gosh, such a nice thing. Uh, I know a lot of people with these collector's booster boxes, I kind of talk about this a little bit every time, but I think for good reason. Um, I know that, you know, this is, this is a premium product for some people and it definitely is priced out of some people's budget. Um, so we're very fortunate that we get to open this at all. Uh, but I, uh, I know that, you know, while some people can't afford it, it still is really fun to watch and, and entertaining to watch these openings. So I certainly hope that, uh, you guys enjoy these. Art Priest of Iona. 
beautiful. Ooh, Zerasand, the Trickster Foil. Beautiful, beautiful card. Uh, the Bayloth here, a Dreadworm. Ooh, World Sculptor, look at that. This is the new uh, Avenger of Zendikar, essentially. But of course, in that beautiful showcase frame, love, 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 uh, that Skyclave Squid again in foil. Ooh, oh, oh, a Windswept Heath foil. Look at that, everyone. That is a treat. That is truly, truly a treat. Look, we're gonna we're gonna set this one over here to the side a little bit. Uh, in fact, these are only penny sleeves, but for now, let's go ahead and sleeve that one up. That one's too good to pass up. My goodness. Woo! Absolutely fantastic. All right, get that token out of there. Uh, whoops. Well, that's a bit of a giveaway, isn't it? Uh, beautiful resolute strike. Light blade here. Cleric of Chill Depths, Champion. Again, kind of going through these relatively quickly because these commons and uncommons are nice, but that that's what we want to see is these beautiful rares. Zagras, Thief of Heartbeats, beautiful card. A River Glide Pathway, very nice. Spitfire Legac. Fearless Fledgling. I love the art on that, that is stunning. Ooh, and a beautiful extended full art Nahiri. Fantastic. We'll keep that over here for now. The Ox. And then as we saw, Ondu Inversion with of course Ondu Sky Ruins on that backside. My goodness, guys. These packs are just stunning. <laughs> uh, I love opening up these premium packs. It truly, like I said, is a treat. Uh, there's just so much, so much awesome stuff. Um, and again, we're gonna run through these very quickly. Uh, I do wanna ask, what's your favorite? Uh, Favorite card and favorite deck in standard right now. Uh, just out of curiosity, um, beautiful charger. Uh, there's a lot of awesome choices in my opinion. Um, so I, I'm just curious to see what you guys are, are playing and what you're loving and uh, maybe some things that you're not so loving of uh, at the moment. Just beautiful pathway, nice little hellhound there. Ooh, and a lithoform engine. This is one of the jankiest cards from the new set. Absolutely love that though. Uh, can't wait to give that a shot. Um, once we get into some more jank decks. Uh, speaking of which, if you are not following the JDC tournament, I highly encourage you to do so. We we finished up week one, uh, very, very awesome week one. Unfortunately, the Charlotte Crabs, which is my team, uh, did not do quite as well. We didn't fare well against the, the Rochester Hydras this week, but I have high hopes for next week. So uh, we will give it a shot. Oops, uh, Soul Shatter. Love that artwork. That's just so stunning. Beautiful foil Lotus Cobra, very nice. Felidar here, there we go. Skyclave Shade, very nice. Beautiful foil pickaxe, a lot of showcase foils in this. Ooh, and a Zagros Thief of Heartbeats foil this time. Look at that, guys. Uh, down to uh, about five packs here. Um, again, I try and take these a little bit slow just because there is so much value in these. Uh, these collector booster boxes are just absolutely insane. Uh, but yeah, I'd like to know what your favorite cards are right now. What your favorite deck is. What are you playing on the ladder? What are you playing just for fun? Nice squad commander. Um, I'm really enjoying a lot of new decks. I do think the, the Demir Rogues deck is quite strong. Uh, and while it is a bit frustrating to play against, it's quite fun to play. <laughs> um, Scoot Swarm here is also a really nice card uh, and I've been enjoying it. But again, I know that's a, that's a very difficult one to talk about at the moment. Um, and of course Omnath is as well, but uh, Felidar Retreat is a deck that I've been, uh, I haven't played yet, uh, or the card that I haven't played yet, but there's a very nice Landfall deck kind of built around it. Um, and I'd love to see how that goes. I'd love to get that going and just see if we can make something happen there, but um, haven't gotten to it yet. That's certainly on the list. Uh, Paragon there, very nice. Ooh, Foil Limbala. Gosh, such a stunning piece of artwork. Dreadworm, Canopy Bayloth. Oh, man, speak of the devil, <laughs> Felidar Retreat, there you go. Uh, Brushfire Elemental Foil that time. And another Foil Skyclave Relic, very nice. All right, guys, three packs left. What are we hoping for? Is there anything that we just really, really want? Well, we've kind of gotten a lot of it, if I'm honest. Uh, got a nice Foil Windswept Teeth here. Uh, we've gotten uh, Nahiri, which is great. I'd love to get a Nissa. Um, that card I have not pulled yet. I've opened a couple boxes, not a ton. Um, and really hoping to get that Ondu Inversion. Hagramalin, fantastic. McKinney Ox, 
Parasite Cat. Ooh, look at that. Gosh, that art. Guys, it looks like Tropical Island. It's beautiful. Uh, there we go. Baloth. Oh, and a foil Omnath Locus of Creation. Guys, oh, such good value. Um, I, I've not priced these as I've gone before, and I, I feel like I should. I feel like um, you might be able to get some really nice value out of these, and obviously you do, but I'd like to just see and kind of add that up at some point, but I never do, to be honest. <laughs> All right, let's get through these. Beautiful swamp. All right, Inscription of Ruin. Ooh, love that. Nice new Minotaur. Nectar Pot, awesome. Geopede. Ooh, well, there we go. Two of them in the same pack. Very nice. Scythe Cat and a Squad Commander finishing us out. All right, last pack, guys. Let's see what we can get here. Um, Gosh, such a, such a phenomenal time. All right, last pack. Let's get through these commons and uncommons. Nothing too crazy here as we know, but lots to be excited about in the last few. Oh, I, one of my favorite new pieces of artwork is this island. I think it is absolutely stunning. All right, Coral Helm Chronicler. Very nice. Oh yes, Cherix, the Raging Isle. This is just a mad crab. Look at that, love it. Nice little squid there. Prowling Felidar, Valakut Exploration. Fantastic, again, beautiful artwork. Another Prowling Felidar, that's interesting. Skyclave Shade, and that is it, guys. That is the last card now. We do, of course, have these two Expedition Lands, so let's see what we get. These are really where you want to uh, pull something awesome. Uh, obviously, that Windswept Teeth is a great start, so. Let's see if we can get this out without doing too much damage to it. All right, three, two, one. Wooded Foothills, very nice. Look at that. Gotten a lot of the Shocklands, actually. I also got a Bloodstain Mire in my first box. Uh, you can go watch that video as well. That one's already up on the channel. All right, last one here, guys. Three, two, one. Boom, Aspire Garden. Not quite as good, but still very, very happy with that, uh, obviously. And man, what a box, guys. I hope you really enjoyed this. This is such a fun time to be able to, to open such powerful cards and just see so many cool things. Uh, I really do hope that you guys enjoy these box openings. Please, again, go show some love to Grand Slam Comics and Collectibles for making this possible. Certainly couldn't do this without them, so thank you uh, hugely to them for, for what they do in support of us. And thank you all for watching. We really do appreciate it, and I will see you very soon for another box opening video.